Okay, well, um, we're back here for another edition of the Reno and Doc Show. Sorry we're a day late doing this, but it's been a really crazy week, and we're here to do, well, what you see right there is a guy who's joining us. This time it's going to be by phone, because unfortunately he can't be with us here, because he's still in jail for a number of reasons. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, that is the face of a man who... <laughs> has bragged so much about doing so many stupid things. It's his actual mugshot. It's our it's our old friend Jerome and uh Jerome, you there, man? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Oh, oh you, you, you guys are my friends still, right? Oh yeah, yeah. We're, oh, we're, oh yeah, we're best yeah, buddies. Yeah, we're we're your best friends, even though you threatened to beat us both up while walking. We're four hundred and fifty feet away. <laughs> four hundred fifty feet away. I'll us. beat you up. Yeah, pretty much what he said. That's all know. I kept hearing. Hey, hey, don't make fun of me, okay, guys? Come on, I, I've been suffering, I've been suffering in this jail. It sucks. I can't stand it anymore. Just, when I get out, I'm kicking your butts. Wait, wait, wait. What? What do we do? You guys are the reason I put it. I was put in here. No, no, you got put in there for beating your woman. Yeah, so she says that's her side of the story. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, all right, okay. What's the real reason you were put in jail? I'd rather not talk about it. What okay. was the real reason? <laughs> what was the real reason, Drum? Shut up. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so, uh, so how's life in prison been so far? I met a very nice man. Uh-oh. <laughs> how's that going? We're gonna get married. This, we're gonna get married in May because it's a nice month to get married. Okay, in. <laughs> I didn't need to know that information. Okay. Sorry, I asked. All right, your own. Well, uh, it's nice to know that uh, you found somebody else to to uh, to be with besides your old lady. He beats me. Okay, well, <laughs> I guess uh, what how do you say it? What comes around, something what, like that. What goes around, comes around. Yeah. Something like that, and uh, sometimes a worm turns on the bird or something like that. I don't know. You know. Don't mention worms. Okay. okay. Why? <laughs> Never mind. All right. Okay, I'm okay. glad. I, I, I might have we'll, to stop asking. We'll, we'll keep. We'll, we'll just keep it like that. Okay. Um. So, Jerome, do you ever think you're? Do you, do you ever think there's a chance you're going to go back and live in Dopeheadville? Oh, probably. Pretty, probably a pretty good chance. I'm going to move back there, and uh, and when I get back there, I'm going to introduce everybody to my new boyfriend. Oh Lord. <laughs> so, um, you mean husband, don't you? Since you married him in May. Well. Well, if I get out on good behavior, I can introduce him to my fiance. His name's Bill. Okay. <laughs> His name's Bill. Okay. Okay. Right. Uh, so, Jerome, uh, you you claim that you that you once bent a cop around a light post. Would you like to explain that? Well, there was more to it than that. Uh, you forget it. Forget it. Forget. We forget. Want, we, we don't want to know. No. 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 Thank you. We don't want to know. Thank you. Anyway. Um, so. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of out of question. I anything, am too. I'm, I'm really out. Anything for him? Nothing. Uh, Not really. I mean, uh, see if I can come up with last question I can come up with is, uh, what's with his face, bud? What's with this look well, you got going here? Okay, I, I want to explain that face. Here's what happened. They said stand still, and I was trying to, but I was drunk. And they pulled and they did the backhand thing, like like when your dad was going to backhand you when you were a kid. And well, I, they caught me at the worst possible moment. I mean, I'm still a man. <laughs> Okay. Okay. All right. If you say so, Jerome. Uh, you know. Uh, but yeah, I mean, uh, it's it's uh, seriously that face, dude. I I don't even know what else to say about it. You know. Yeah. Well, I can. Well, if you ever do it to me, I'm gonna make that same face. Okay. Okay. So, All right. All right. Well, uh, well, Jerome, I want to say it was good talking to you, but honestly, I find you an annoying idiot. And uh, and if they ever do let you out, I hope I hope uh, Boomba will. Will accept you and your new fiance, and uh, not really. I'm trying to be nice to the guy, and uh, hope you two have a very happy life together. All right, you guys are invited to the wedding. No I, thanks. Uh, uh, we're gonna have to turn that down. Thanks anyway. Invite Tyner, he'll go. But uh, yeah, maybe we can invite a couple of guys named uh, in, in magazine who who might want to go along with you. I've already contacted them. They said they're gonna be my my they'll be my bridesmaids. Let's get to the voicemails. Can we get to the voicemails? I'm getting sick here. Let's get to the voicemails. Uh, uh, Jerome, uh, we 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 gotta go. I got. No, I want two more minutes. No, 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 Click. no. no we got, uh, darn it! Darn, 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 darn. Take you more darn of that. Luck. All right, let's get darn to the, the luck. Let's get these Gosh, voicemails. Darn it. 
What do we got going well, here? Well, such a gosh darn shame that poor Jerome, we couldn't talk to him any longer. Uh, was, yeah, I didn't even know any more about his bridesmaids. Yeah. That was just disgusting. Gosh, gosh darn all the luck. So let's get to our voicemails real, real quick. And um, hopefully we got some normal ones this week. Let's get to voicemail numero uno. Oh, hold on. Uh, one of your biggest fans. I'm, uh, well, you can just call me uh, Patrick, yeah, because I know I, I kind of sound like that that guy from that cartoon that you guys like to watch, Underdog. Anyway, <laughs> okay. just wanted to tell you guys, I love your show. And, uh, oh, thank you. And, uh, he sounds drunk. And I heard you guys are going to have a prisoner on your show, so uh, yeah. hopefully he doesn't uh, drop the soap in front of you guys. Uh, Take care, that, guys. That's, that's not funny, man. That's really not funny. Okay, well, uh, thank you, uh, Patrick, for, for calling in and uh, leaving a voicemail. I appreciate it, man, and I uh, hope you keep watching. Always glad we got our fans. Thank and, you for watching. Uh, yeah, he, he didn't do anything like that, Patrick, so you know, thank, thank the good Lord for that. So. No, I'd have kicked him right straight in the head. We had him. <laughs> okay, so let's get to voicemail number, well, turn this, let's get to voicemail number two. I guess I got Vicky Gray to go get to him soon, but um, uh, what? let's see. Fish and gravy is what he said. He's talking so fast. Uh, so, um, love show. One of my fellow prisoners, I understand, has come on the show. He was a good bitch. Especially I didn't need to know that. I don't always get get that from you. Yeah. You want to know my name? Sure. Can't tell nobody. Okay. Wait, really? Holy shit! Did you just steal my catchphrase, bud? I, I think he did. Fucker and asshole. We're still in my catchphrase. Good to hear from you, buddy. Well, we hope you'll be Too out Too much real information. Real we hope you'll be out real, real soon, though, man. Well, right, we right, hopefully let's, should be. Let's get to voicemail number three. Hi, uh, guys. Oh, no. Is, uh, uh, well, it's not who you think it is. Oh, okay. But uh, I just want to say uh, I think you guys... You guys are doing a real good, fine job on this on this here channel. Thank you. And uh, you know, big fan, big fan of you guys. Oh, you know, very uh, cool. You know who doesn't like you guys, but you know, she knows where she can go and she can stick it. You know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, guys, you guys keep up the good work. Love your show, guys. Okay. Take care and uh, God bless you both. Thank you. And, uh, don't tell you know who I called you. She already knows, right? <laughs> Hopefully, she doesn't know. <laughs> okay. I mean, if she watches, I don't know, but uh, whoops, but yeah. All right, let's get to voicemail number four. Howdy. I'm glad to be on y'all show. I come from uh, Seymour, Texas. Oh. Uh, Hello, Seymour. Y'all show down here, and I want to thank y'all for bringing them live shows and uh, well. doing everything. Uh, you know, Seymour mentioned occasionally, guys. Uh, but uh, anyway, uh, we want to thank you for your show, and uh, hope you enjoy oh, your welcome. visit with whoever the hell you're going to have on there. But Not really. Thank you for thank you for doing it. Bye bye now. Oh yeah, thank you. Thank take you. care. Yeah, he thanks us for doing it. We had to put up with that crap. I see here, Seymour, Texas. I can mention Seymour, Texas. I've been to Seymour, Texas once. Uh, did some wind farms there, or help pour concrete for them. Shitty little town. <laughs> <laughs> for a town in Texas, it's oh, it's a nice. small one. It's a smaller. It's, it's a little bit smaller than Boogle, I think. All righty, well. Guys, I want to thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the Reno Reno Eat and the Reno Vega. Yeah. Uh, Doctor Metal Freak, yeah. Grease Monkey Twelve Fifteen. Who should be out pretty soon? We hope. I'm. I'm getting some good news on that. Uh, okay. I won't say it exactly because I don't know for sure. But somebody told me maybe next month. So hopefully. Yeah. Um. Let's see. Let's not forget. Uh, oh, uh, Big B Fresh. And that uh, Big B's little B, little B, little, little B. B's Sorry, little, little B Fitness. Sorry. Oh, she's going to kick your butt. God damn, I get names confused today. How can you get her name confused? Let's see. That other idiot who lives in Paris. Other idiot. Oh. That right. How do I get confused with that? With that hot hot and stink reviews? <laughs> uh, anyway, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Mad Men's Fresh Reviews. Little Beast Fitness. Sorry about that, Little B. Uh, and that'll do it. We'll see you next time. Peace. Oh.